Hello, Sally Chowdhury here. I uh, wanted to make this video just to probably talk about exactly what I've been doing for the last 12 months after leaving the police to get onto um, online marketing. Now, I've actually had to play catch up um, and really put my head down and lock myself in a room uh, and put myself up to a level where I'm actually generating quite a substantial amount. Um, not, it's not bragging, but I think it, it's fair that I can say that because I worked hard, like many other people have probably worked hard that are doing it right now. And you've got to appreciate why some of some of the guys that are in the industry for some time, um, they've been working for years, building up the authority or credibility, and even the strategies that they've been doing. You've got to realise uh, a lot of time gets invested in a lot of money and expertise, finding those. Uh, affiliates joint venture partners etc etc so um, I've been recently really working behind the scenes doing a lot of testing and doing a lot in, a lot of investing in myself and a lot of people feel fail to see that element of it is spending money uh, or is essentially you've got to invest in your education and trying different things if you're doing what everyone else is doing um, then nothing's really got to work. You've got to actually try something um, that you might fail in. And some of these stuff, I'm not even going to get into it because it's all cliche, you know, I'll take action or fail at this or fail at that. Well, it's all true, but everyone's said it so many times. It just there's, You can't really associate any feeling towards it. Uh, once you actually understand how to take your mindset to another level where you can actually tap into pure willpower, uh, believe it or not, well, it's, it's just then... Um, anything's possible when you actually understand uh, how to do that. So, um, yeah, just working a few projects at the moment. Um, there's some very, very big projects coming on and actually working on uh, one um, currently where we're going to be working towards getting 10k a day, which some people are already making and it's not, I wouldn't imagine it's not a huge deal. Um, so it's a case of that's going to be very, very interesting, especially how going to get some people on board to actually replicate exactly the processes that are involved with that. Now people might not know me, people say who's this guy, he's coming along now and he's putting you know X, Y and Z on, he's putting X, Y and Z out there and you know just showing what he's doing and some people might like it, some people may not like it and to me I honestly couldn't care less because I know what I need to be doing and I know what I will be doing and I know where I'm going so I already know my outcome. And I'm just doing it in stages, so yeah, I just want to sh uh, actually say that. If anyone is actually planning to do anything and you're worrying about what other people think, then you've got an issue basically. You need to stop worrying what anyone else is thinking about and do it for yourself. Who cares what, uh, if people are saying, oh, who, who does this person think he is? Or, oh, you know, what's he doing here and there? Who cares? Do what you have to do, do it for yourself, understand why you're doing it, and make sure it's for yourself and no one else. And actually ask yourself, what do you really want? So many people um, actually are doing things and they don't really understand what, why they're doing it for. They don't understand the real purpose. And when you don't have the purpose, you won't have the belief and then you won't really have that motivation or the real power or the urge um, to actually go ahead and follow through with it. So many people start things and then they don't finish it or end it and it just results in giving up. Well, that's fair enough, give up. You know, um, it doesn't affect me. Um, but as as when you come to a stage where you're you're so you know you're you're hungry uh, for success, uh, I think someone said it's as badly as you want to breathe. That that's just a, a completely different level. So just gotta watch out. I'm definitely um, looking to do very very big things in 2014, and it's already started for me now. Um, if, if anyone wants to um, enjoy their Christmas and uh, relax, go ahead. You know, this is the time now to get a, a jump start on anyone else uh, at the moment. And I am going to leverage uh, the time I have now to really maximise this season, should we say. Um, so, I think that's about it, to be honest. Just remember, there's a lot of, there's a lot of people that will help. If you actually ask them, if you actually turn around and said, look, I need a bit of help. Can you actually share some of the stuff that you know? To a level, yes, you will share it. But 
one thing I've realized, I value my time and everything that I've been investing in with time and money. So what I will say, to a point, if you, if you don't value yourself and the information, then what's the point? Then basically, it's not really a business, then keep it as a hobby. Um, but apart from that, that's about it. I wanted to make this video to say that, you know, who, who, don't ever worry about what anyone ever, what, what everyone else is saying or what they're doing. Worry about yourself, don't worry about anyone else but yourself. And, um, you know, it's time to actually build relationships and help one another to actually succeed. Uh, but if I'm completely honest, as well as that is true, you can, it comes to a point where you've got to rely on yourself. Don't expect anyone to really help you. Do it for yourself. Get where you need to be and um, just do what you have to do. Make 2014, dominate it, you know, uh, like a game of chess, think five steps ahead and actually make it worthwhile. Make it better than this year if you haven't already, period. No matter how bad it is or how bad it gets, I'm going to make it. I want to represent an idea. I want to represent possibilities. And some of you right now, you want to be, you know what I'm saying? You want to go to the next level. I want to counsel. You know, I want to be an engineer. I want to be a doctor. Listen to me. You can't get to that level. You can't get to the level economically where you want to be until you start investing in your mind. You're not reading books. I'm challenging y'all to go to conferences. I dare you to invest time. I dare you to be alone. I dare you to spend an hour getting to know yourself. When you become who you are, when you become the person that you were created to be, designed to be who you were designed to be, when you become an individual, what you do is you take yourself and you start separating yourself from other people. I challenge you to get to a place where people don't like you, it don't even bother you no more. Why? Because you're not concerned with trying to make them happy because you're trying to blow up. You're trying to get to the next level. I need you to invest in your mind. Invest in your mind. If you still talk about your dream, if you still talk about your goal, but you have not done anything, just take the first step. That you can make your parents proud, you can make your school proud, you can touch millions of people's lives, and the world will never be the same again because you came this way. Don't let nobody steal your dream. After we face a rejection and a no, or we have a meeting and no one shows up, or somebody say, you can count on me, and they don't come through. What if we have that kind of attitude, the cause repossessed, nobody believes in you, you've lost again and again and again, the lights are cut off, but you're still looking at your dream, reviewing it every day and saying to yourself, it's not over until I win. You can live your dreams!